consistent driver. Uh, got a lot of style in that car. Moko working his way up here. Both drivers are going to stay relatively close off the 50 roll. Insane holds it nice and wide. Big style on the chase, but Insane oh, yeah. may have dropped the tire, and that's going to oh, be a no. little bit of a straighten on a Moco as well. Lots of sloppy driving from the lead and the chase. Insane once again going to run it a little bit wide through the inner zone of turn two, transitioning for three. Good angle, good speed, but lots of mistakes out of both drivers here. We're going to resume this battle. So both drivers can look for a little bit of a smoother run this time by Moko. Going to do just that as he initiates really hard, runs the rumble strip, maybe a little bit of a tire drop into the dirt as he exits turn one. Insane. Running a little bit wide, not quite able to get down to the inside to match what Moko is doing up front. Moko, lots of angle, lots of speed, and lots of style as he finishes out the run. Insane getting a little bit phased. Very soon with some more uh, esports competition for you. So now that we have shaken the nerves from the first round, both drivers looking for a lot better of a run this time around, getting that second chance. One more time battle here in top 24. Insane! Throwing oh, big no. angle into one. That might have messed up Moko, or Moko might have charged too hard. Once again, that's going to be an interesting judging decision. As Insane is going to not let them phase him and do a good job bringing it down to the inside of turn two. Moko not quite able to do the same, but bringing the proximity into the door as they both finish turn three really strong. But once again, turn one. Caused really affected his exit as well. Maybe it was the contact as well, but we're going to go to the judge stand once again on that call. But we got a second half of this battle to finish out. OMT battle once again between Moko and Insane. Camaro going to try to keep it close this time, and he will do just that. Moko actually getting a little bit of a gap this time. Once again, going to run it down towards the inside of the exit of one. As they both transition for the second corner. Moko running really wide this time in turn two, completely missing that inner white line. And Insane going to bring it in. Almost catches Dorm and may have actually cut the course a little bit to close that proximity. However, Moko, I love your Nezi cosplay. It's great. Five out of seven, mates. <laughs> I gotta say, it like the one girl in Forza Horizon 4. Gets a five out of seven. All right, here we go. Rousey on the lead. <laughs> I am sorry, I'll never do it again. And Rousey, uh, yeah, you're just gonna see some top caliber driving oh, no. right now as he is just starting to pull away. And actually, our 34 says, uh-uh, I'm not letting you get away just yet, but uh, a little too aggressive on the center of two. And Rousey transitions to the third corner and finishes uh, the top 16 by default. He'd get enough points to win regardless. So, Man. quick maths. Here we go. Maoko going to lead. Rousey yeah. uh, doesn't really need to get too aggressive now. Don't need to risk it. And uh, I don't know if he's going to play it smart or he's going to go hard. It's Rousey. He's probably going to go hard. Moko throws hard, being smooth at least, giving a good line for Rousey to chase. Rousey going to give it a little bit of footbreak to come across. Moko with a little bit of an early transition, going to check up Rousey just ever so slightly. Rousey does a good job at saving it. Moko transitioning back to the third corner. And despite that little mistake, Moko showing well for himself. He's going to finish up. The day, it's, well, still, it's still wet. No, no, hold on, though. We didn't even talk about the contents of the water. You have salt water. Mm -hmm. versus normal water you have less volume versus nearly infinite volume but yeah potato potato you're right i agree 100 so There's here we go this is moko is water, wet? water is not wet so here we go we're gonna finish out the hot run. dog a sandwich <laughs> <laughs> oh moko getting a little bit spicy there too i thought that's one might off. Have been going around one off but that's not a shutdown that's not a zero Dude. and moko will advance to your losers grade eight I have to reach, you have to retrain your consistent and smooth driver. Has a lot of style in that back pocket, though, so that could throw him off. Moko's got to start getting really aggressive here on his files if he wants any chance at advancing towards your next round. Oeno going to send it in pretty deep. Moko initiating oh. a little bit earlier, and that's going to let Oeno, maybe a little bit of a bobble, actually, on the exit of one. What he gained through the center, he just lost on exit. Moko, really good angle in the follow, actually. Oh. Not quite getting bad there, Oeno. Oh, bad line, bad line, bad line, oh, there bad line, he goes. Line. He transitions a little too late. Too That's going to be ooh, very close to two. May have just no, been I one. I saw two. And just pushed out wide and didn't shut down enough. And I think it dropped the tires. Hey, hey, CFTQ, you're ugly. All right. So, Moko throwing big into the corner, as he's always been doing here. And, oh, right on the line. I don't know if there was a drop there. Oeno letting him get away just ever so slightly. But Moko creeping his way up the racetrack, allowing Oeno to close that gap. Transitions across the bumper. Oh, oh good adjustment. Dirt. Great adjustment. Not